Hi Aquarius, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of April 17, 2017. Thank you guys for stopping by. If you're looking for a personal reading, please contact me on my website at www.ms-swami.com. You'll find a link to that below these videos. And if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, bear with me. I'm working through some allergies, so may have a little coughing spell come up here. Does look like there's some new doors opening for you guys. There's some new money. Uh, I'm seeing the signing of a contract. Uh, perhaps this is a large purchase or a new lease. Communication remains wide open for Aquarius, and some of this has got past communications attached to it. So let's take a look. This is for Aquarius for the week of April 17, 2017. Okay, Aquarius, we start with the Ten of Wands, followed by the Three of Cups, the Seven of Wands, the Page of Swords, the Wheel of Fortune, and the Chariot. Wonderful combination, guys. Reminding you were under Mercury Retro, you're under the time of the unexpected. Uh, Ten of Wands shows that you're overcoming your obstacles and moving forward nicely. The Three of Cups indicates a celebration of some sorts this week. And then we have the Seven of Wands. It shows that you are overcoming obstacles one at a time. For a lot of you, I find this to be more in your personal life than I do in your work or career. Moving forward, we have Happiness. We see this here in the Page of Swords, even though your defense is up a little bit. Wheel of Fortune shows that you are in complete limbo here. You're wondering if things are going to go good or if they're going to go to the bad. Well, followed beside that is the chariot. And the chariot indicates you get what you want. This is your yes answer. This is everything moving forward. This is everything that you want comes together. Moving forward, we have the Hierophant. We have the Two of Swords. And we have the Five of Wands. What this means to you, this is decisions. This is rethinking your options. This is making future plans, probably starting for late spring, going into summer, doing things differently, and trying to figure out how you're going to do so without creating obstacles. So really what I'm looking at is that we're ending the week with you wanting change and how to implement those changes. So let's look at your major arcanas for the week we have is the Wheel of Fortune. Like I said, you're looking for things to go either way. It does show that you get what you want. And we see that in the Chariot. And then we have the Hierophant. This is you implementing change. This is you saying that things need to be different. Um, torn on this one because it is a general reading. For some of you, this is in your work and career. And for some of you, this is in your personal life. But overall, what I'm looking at is a definite week of you pushing forward. And don't forget, you have a celebration in hand as well. So not a bad week at all for Aquarius, even though you're under Mercury Retrograde. So thank you for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.